pile of problems is growing in Rutherford County. Solid waste officials say illegal dumping is getting even worse as the population increases. News Channel 5's Matthew Torres explains how the court system is now getting involved. On what should be a quiet spot in Murfreesboro, a pile of tree chunks has become a branch of an ongoing problem. Has been told to not come and dump um, his business debris here. Police say a man operating a tree cutting service out of his home dumped tree waste behind a restaurant on Northwest Broad Street. He's accused of doing this five other times and was even cut off from using the city's solid waste site. He has been caught um, dumping illegally here. Uh, this site for mulching is only for residential use and he has his own private business. They try to keep limbs like these small uh, just because it goes through the processing easier. Rutherford County Solid Waste Spokesperson Hannah Bleem says business owners are supposed to get rid of tree debris at the county's landfill and pay a fee. It's hard for a government to really know whether it is coming from a resident or a business, especially if they have vehicles that aren't marked with the business name. While there is no hard data, she says there is a noticeable increase in illegal dumping. This specific case is the first to be on a police report. And this incident will be, if not one of the first few cases to enter Rutherford County's first ever environmental court. It began this month to handle specific cases like illegal dumping. Illegal burning, animals running at large, and it's just giving the court a time to uh, specifically cover issues like this, where in the past um, this issue was thrown in with many other larger issues. The business owner won't physically be arrested, but will have to appear in court. A new system hoping to cut the root of a growing issue. In Murfreesboro, Matthew Torres, News Channel 5. Environmental court is on the first Wednesday of each month at 1 o'clock in Murfreesboro. Fines can range from $50 to $2,000.